On the northwest track, McLaughlin Harvey installed 18 miles of new rails. They were allowed two months to complete. So we decided new rails only, bought new rails, welded them together to form a continuous rail which has no joints and no, no place of weakness. There's up to 2,000 to 3,000 wells having to be put in place. To carry out these welding we've brought in a, a subcontractor who supplied a welding machine from Germany which can drop a weld in five minutes. Not only do you have to comply with your own company's health and safety measures, you have to comply with NIR's health and safety measures. It's a relatively straightforward piece of work because welding rails is well established as, as a, a process. However, to do it in the time scales for such a long distance, 18 miles in two months, is a lot of rails. There was 10 road level crossings in this section, which are quite a challenge. They had to deal with the road service, the local people put up signs, and I thought McLaughlin and Harvey stepped up very well. They got themselves very well organised, employed good subcontractors who knew what they were doing. So the process was well controlled and done very efficiently.